Oh. Oh, it's almost pain. Oh. Uh, all right. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. <clears throat> ah, this hurts. Oh. Happy Saturday. Um, I usually film these videos on Sunday, but since football season is now officially over, well, the regular season, half of football is officially over, I've decided that for today's video, we look at some of the playoff games that are going to be going on this weekend. Um, starting with wild card weekend, um, we got like, I think, two games today and then two games tomorrow. So, I think... Starting with the, the Texans and Colts, we're going to work our way from the AFC side of things into the NFC side of things. And then I'm, I'm going to give you all my, my picks for um, teams that are going to, well, hopefully teams that I choose are going to win. Um, so, starting with the Texans versus the Colts, I'm going to say um, I know nothing defensively about the Colts. As a team, um, offensively, they're great. You know what I'm saying? Good. They got a good quarterback in Andrew Luck, um, a decent quarterback. You know what I'm saying? A couple. They do got some dangerous weapons on offense. You know, they got Eric Ebron. Um, who else? Who else they got? What's his name? T.Y. Hilton. You know what I'm saying? Fast, One of the fastest receivers. Um, very dangerous receiver at that. Um, so offensively, they're stacked. Um, defensively, like I said, I don't really know nothing about them. You know what I'm saying? Houston, I, I feel like Houston might just might just lose. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to just go with Indy for the fact that I don't really know anything about Houston other than the fact that they got a good offense and their defense is a little – their defense is good, but it's not like, you know what I'm saying, too great. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to go with Indy um, to win this game um, and then move on. Um, What else? You did that. Always getting interrupted. All right. Um, well, after being interrupted for like two minutes, um, moving on to the NFC side of things, we got the Cowboys versus the Seahawks um, for the last wild card game of today. Um, I am going to go ahead. Um, I'm not a Cowboy fan. Um, I've seen the Cowboys play this season um, a little. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm too focused on the Patriots. Because obviously the Patriots are on my team. Um, so for me, w watching this game is going to be fun. You know what I'm saying? Uh, they got the late game today. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, and, and just choose the Cowboys for the, for the fact that I don't really, you know what I'm saying? I don't really like the Seahawks like that. Um, Russell Wilson is cool. Good quarterback. Dak Prescott is also a good quarterback. They got a strong run game out there in Dallas. Um, defensively, I feel like they, they kind of lack defensively um, when it comes to like late game situations. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like we, we got a similar situation out there in, in New England. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I'm going to just give the edge to the Cowboys in this game. Um, and hopefully they win. Moving on, we got the... Um, Sunday, Sunday, two games on Sunday. Um, who is it? The the um, I know the Chargers and Ravens play. I forgot what NFC. Oh, the um, Eagles and Bears. Um, 
I'm going to go Sunday. I'm going to pick the... See, because I hate the Ravens. And I don't really... Yep, I, I hate the Ravens so much. So, since I hate the Ravens, I'm going to just go with the Chargers. Fuck it. Phil Rivers has been going off lately, um, late in the season. So, I'm going to just go with the, with the Chargers. And, um, yeah, that's that's that. Um, they should be able to move on to the division around. Um, and then all the matchups will be set in the AFC. Um, yeah, the Ravens got a stacked defense. Their, their defense is, like, number one overall this year. That's fine. Whatever. Cool. You know what I'm saying? No one cares how you perform in the regular season. It's all about now how you perform in the playoffs. You know what I'm saying? You can have the number one defense and still lose. You know what I'm saying? We've seen that happen in the Super Bowl. Hint, hint. The Patriots did it to the Seahawks. You know what I'm saying? Then they, they they had the number one defense in 2000. What was that? 2014? Lost. Trash. You know what I'm saying? Um... Or was that 2016? Don't matter, you know what I'm saying? Still lost. Um, moving on. We got our friendly, friendly brothers in um, Philadelphia. The Philadelphia Eagles taking on the Chicago Bears. <sighs> Philly, Philly, Philly. The city of brotherly love, Philadelphia. Oh, the um, the pain and agony they caused us last year. For the simple fact that I cannot stand Nick Foles, and I don't really see them going past the second round, even if they were to beat the Bears. Um, and I'm not going to say that they're going to beat the Bears. My prediction is the Bears beat them. Um, for the simple fact that I don't even think if they get past the Bears that they're going to play the Rams or Saints. Um... I am going to say that the the Bears are going to win. You know what I'm saying? I have no faith um, in Nick Foles at all. I don't care about his little um, history of of doing damage this far into the season. You know what I'm saying? Um, when it comes to his success in the playoffs, I don't care about it. You know what I'm saying? Go write another little fairy tale and tell us how you how you went from being a Super Bowl champion to. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we got to the playoffs when no one no one wanted us to. You know what I'm saying? No one thought we would get here. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure they said the same thing about the Patriots this year. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we fell off. You know what I'm saying? Tom Brady, there there it is. He's done. The Patriots are over. The dynasty is over. It's over with. You know what I'm saying? The Patriots lost it. Um, so write your little fairy tale ending. You know what I'm saying? Good little, good little, you know what I'm saying? Congratulations, you made it to the playoffs. Good shit. Now, now go lose to the goddamn Bears. Um, that that Bears defense, once again, another great defense. You know what I'm saying? I think it's like number one as well. I don't see how they can have no, two number one defenses um, in the NFL. It's kind of weird to me. Um, I don't know, man. I got I got the Bears winning. I, I don't know nothing about Chicago. I just know their defense is great, and for that reason, I'm going with the Bears. Um, and yeah, that is that. that. Those are my predictions. So my predictions, once again, for Wild Card Weekend. 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 My predictions for Wild Card Weekend. We, God damn, my nigga. My predictions for Wild Card Weekend. I got Indy, um, the Chargers. Then I got the Cowboys. And the Bears. And um, that is going to be that. You know what I'm saying? Um, but, you know what I'm saying? Good luck to all these teams that are in the wild card. You know what I'm saying? As a Patriot fan, once again, for the ninth year in a row, I get to chill out and um, not have a heart attack. You know what I'm saying? For, for the first week of the playoffs. You know what I'm saying? So, salute to my team for at least getting that first round by and giving our team a chance to be healthy. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to end this video here. Smash the like button.
fight for fucking sleep. Oh, my leg hurt. Oh. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, make sure you guys post notifications, turn on all that, and I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow's video. I hope y'all heard me. Love y'all. Why did I do that? Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, make sure you got your post notifications turned on and all that. And I'm, I'm going to see y'all in tomorrow's video. Make sure you got your post notifications turned on as well. Love y'all.